welcome back. I'm Marilyn with Shady and Y. I am back with a bag of jewelry. Yay! Um, if y'all haven't been here before, I have a serious jewelry addiction, but I have no problem sharing. So, um, if you see anything that you like, definitely just send me an email with a um, screenshot or a timestamp that will help. What this is, is this is a bag from our local estate auction. I um, think this bag is absolutely fabulous. You are gonna be excited to see it as I am. I can't wait to get into it. So um, let's just dive right in. Um, as I'm opening this, I will tell you that um, as I said, if there's anything that you see that you would like to purchase, just let me know in an email with a timestamp and a um, or a photo, the name of the video. And also, be sure to give me your address and your PayPal email. That way, I can get you a PayPal invoice. This is... Like I said, from our local estate auction, we have an auction that has a jewelry counter and um, they have um, a certified jeweler there and she is amazing. So we get some pretty outstanding pieces there. This piece actually says gold or this lot is gold filled art deco and compact anything that says art deco i am nuts for and um i did go to this auction um so i did see this in person ahead of time um but you know you're there that day and you don't have a lot of time or um there's a lot of people so you don't have a lot of um opportunity to look in detail so i'm excited with you to see what we have for this lot i paid a hundred and twenty dollars um so hopefully we have enough in here that's going to pay for that and the main reason i just was gaga over this was this piece right here i don't really collect compacts but when i see something this amazing i cannot help myself this is a compact with an attached lipstick um this is just not in the absolute best shape but it's pretty amazing let's see if i can get this open yeah you just push down and then you open and and here is the blush and the mirror and then here is the powder. It says patent patent pending. Um, I haven't, like I said, I didn't open this or anything, so I don't know if it has a name. Um, so I might have to do a little bit of um, research on this piece. I'm going to get back with you on this piece. I'm gonna do some follow-up on a couple of pieces that people have asked about. This is the lipstick and you just slide it out and then there's the up down, uh, very cool. So I'm gonna do a follow-up video on any pieces that I don't put a price on and I'm just gonna call it a follow-up because a couple of people have asked about other videos and other items. The next piece, is this guitar or banjo it's made out of mother of pearl it has real strings it's a pen it's not signed it's a ruler it's actually a mandolin mother of pearl with 10 karat gold filled and um very nice um let's say 12 dollars oh this is such a cute piece and check this out a little pillow inside is a little ring but how perfect would this be for 
an engagement. But on the back, it says USA patent applied for. And then let's see what that says. Denison patent applied for USA. That is just so sweet. Like a little engagement ring would be too cute in that. I love it. This is such a great piece and um, it's kind of rare because it's complete. It has the um, little fake ring, uh, pearl ring. It's just plastic. And um, then you would put your real ring in here. And um, another um, could be a great presentation for an engagement ring. Also a wonderful um, ring bearer piece. So let's say um, 25 on this one. If you haven't um, researched um, engagement ring boxes or anything like that, definitely just take the time, you know, type it into your browser. Um, and I have sold some just boxes with no rings, just leather boxes back from the Victorian Art Deco for over a hundred dollars. So definitely be sure to check that out. Anytime you see an old box that is interesting, old jewelry box, definitely look into that. Here we have um, a little um, poodle charm. So cute has something right here. Let's see what that says. It says 1 20th of 12 karat gold. Oh, that's sweet. If anybody has a poodle, that is a perfect piece. Nice. I think the majority of this lot is from the 20s to the 50s, and I believe this piece to be so also. So let's say 15 for this one. And look at this. As I um, said yesterday on the video, I had just purchased this from online. I saw it. My mom used to have one of these and it's a tape measure. Um, great memories for me. Um, as I said, I'm gonna search for one for my mom because I want her to have one too. But these generally are anywhere from the 20s to the 50s and um, anywhere from 20 to about $35. This one is going to be NSF as I'm going to keep it for myself. And as you pull the tape measure out, it does say on the little strip made in Germany. Very, very nice. Fabulous. Here we have a 10 karat gold filled with a signature. Let's see if I can remember who this is. Oh. It's a W and an S. I will add that because I'm not sure. That is a 12 and a quarter. That is a beautiful, look at the crisscross detail in this. Very nice. Like I said, it just says 10 karat gold fill and um, a W and an S. So I'll add the maker in that. Here's another one. This one says the same thing, 10 karat gold filled with a W and an S. It, um, is also a 12 and a quarter. Very nice. That's a, um, like it has just a little bit of a dome, not much, um, but beautiful. Great rings. Here is another one. This one says, 
not the my loop for this one says 10 karat gold filled that is combs uh, I'm gonna have to look at the name gosh my memory's off today it's um a C and a C um, so I uh, it's combs and coat or coat and combs um, beautiful that is a size seven and a half and look at that beautiful um, crystal that is beautiful very pretty with my chubby little fingers today okay I am going to make this video really short tonight and have a part two for tomorrow and um, give you major, major details because some pieces that we're coming up on, I want you to get um, a lot of information that hopefully will be helpful for you. I um, hope you have enjoyed this sneak little peek at um, our um, auction um, tray that we have. And um, thank you so much for joining us. If you have any comments, definitely leave them below. If you're interested in anything that we've already gone over, um, just send me an email, um, timestamp or a photo, and I will send you a PayPal invoice. So I'm hoping that um, you have a wonderful day. And thank you so much for um, subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please do so below and hit that bell to the all button so you know when our next video will be out and you will get a notice. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of your day with us and see you on part two. Bye-bye.